One of the scores in the fitness industry or in a medical setting that you'll often hear is BMI, and that stands for Body Mass Index. And there's a lot of controversy about that particular term now because in a lot of cases where somebody is very lean, they're carrying a lot of muscle mass, they will actually show up on that as, as obese or a score that allots something to what would be an unhealthy range. So BMI, they're looking at your height and your weight, so your mass compared to your height. And if somebody is carrying a lot more muscle mass, they're actually going to obviously have a poor BMI score. But what's more important is more of a body fat index or something where you're looking at how much fat weight are you carrying. And there's multiple ways to measure that. So when we're measuring that, there is submersion techniques where we know that fat is obviously more buoyant than uh, muscle mass. There is skin fold measurements. There's also electronic devices that we use now to record those. And what's most important is that it's not necessarily about um, your measurements that depict how you are feeling. Because somebody who can have very little body fat can be very thin, but can also be very unhealthy. So let's look at the other markers that are more important. What's your resting heart rate? How's your blood pressure? What's your energy like in a day? So let's focus on the things that make you feel good and not just lock in on stats that are going to probably demotivate you instead of motivate you.